Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to do a demonstration with a Teo Metro RC Typhoon Hovercraft toy from 1989. What you're looking at here on the right, the Black Typhoon, is the one that was gifted to me for Christmas 1989, so I was nine years old. And on the left is the one that I found in a opportunity shop or an op shop on the Gold Coast. I believe it was the Animal Welfare League in Mermaid Beach. And would you believe it was only five dollars so it was up on the shelf up high on the shelf and i saw it and had to have it so the box is a little bit rough um, but it came complete with the controller so this controller here actually belongs to the white hovercraft uh, the battery tray which was a little bit corroded but i've got a battery tray in that one as well um, but otherwise yeah it was pretty much complete for five dollars and uh, if so all I have of the black Typhoon is the Typhoon itself. The controller, I believe, might be at Mum's. I've had a look, I can't find it. The Typhoon was at Mum's. I found it in a box, but uh, no controller, unfortunately. And they're not interchangeable between the Typhoons because the black Typhoon is on a 27 megahertz frequency, the white on a 40. So if my thinking is correct, any 27 megahertz controller should work because I just need the levers to control the rear fans. The button on top actually controls the motor, which lifts the Typhoon. Um, so yeah, let me know in the comments if that's the case, and I just might buy an aftermarket one. So in today's video, I'm just going to be doing a demo with the white one in the garage because that's a smooth surface, it needs a smooth surface. And um, just before I get started, I've also just cleaned them up. So if I just take you in to the black one, uh, just assemble both of them to the point where they were completely apart. All the fans, the vents, the propellers, the lift fan, everything's been cleaned inside out on both of them. So they've Nice and clean and Okay, to switch on the hovercraft you just press the red button on the top here Lights up red and then just switch on the controller so I'll just put it on the ground first. Okay. Here we go. Just one thing with the controller, if you need to dump the hovercraft because you're about to crash into something, there's just a button on the back here. So you just press that orange button down, which it's called pause. So that just uh, switches off the lift fan. Well, I'll leave it there. I hope you uh, enjoyed the little trip back to the late 80s. Uh, any comments or questions, leave them below and I'll get back to you. And uh, if I get the black hovercraft working, I'll be sure to make another video so you can see that one hovering around the garage. But for now, thanks for watching. Cheers.